Hi there, I'm Gabrielle, retired medium in Germany, and I like to share some of my experiences. So, <clears throat> I already told that as a medium, I'm doing this since uh, 13 years now, when I go to bed and close my eyes, I always see a lot of uh, images and I feel like in short video clips where I experience encounters with other beings or I see uh, like short clips, something uh, to, to learn and to understand. So <clears throat> this one night I closed my eyes and suddenly found myself in some kind of um, cloudy environment. I saw um, pieces of white mist all around me and then my vision got from the inner eye more centralized and I was looking um, onto a special thing that was a cloud, a big, white, fluffy cloud. And they were there were people on this cloud, standing and sitting there with dangling legs. That was really funny. And the figures I saw um, were human-shaped. They had the form of humanoids, head, torso, two arms, two legs. But they were uh, translucent. And it was as if they were like a body of glass filled inside with white cloudy uh, mist that is swirling around in them. And I could see that. And I saw that they all, uh, they all hold, uh, had something in their hand, like a, a glass ball or something like that. Like... Um, I, as a child, I still used to play with marbles and it reminded me of marbles. It was a bit bigger. It had the, the size maybe of an apple or an orange. And all of these white figures were holding a ball like that in their hand. And I was getting curious about this ball, so I came closer in my vision and I looked at the ball, and when I looked inside this marble ball they had in their hands, I saw that in the ball there were swirling galaxies and stars and space. And it reminded me um, very much of a scene from the um, movie Man in Black, where in this one episode there is the big cockroach coming from space and is after the belt of Orion, which is a pendant which one of the other extraterrestrials had on the neck of his cat. And in this uh, pendant, it was like a ball, there were swirling galaxies. So it was that um, what the... Uh, counterpart, the cockroach in the Man in Black movie was after, swirling galaxies in some kind of glass pendant. And it looked the same what they um, had in their hands on the cloud. And I moved closer and closer to one of these figures sitting on the cloud with dangling legs and this ball in its hand. And they were all very focused uh, looking inside this um, glass ball with their swirling galaxies in there. And um, I thought, wow, wh wh what is that? And as we humans always like to put names and words on something to define it or to, to get a grasp, I was looking for a word or for a name of these um, figures. And it suddenly dawned upon me that they are creators. And I call them for myself the creators. And a short while after I had this experience, um, funnily enough, I found um, Daniel Scranton on the internet who is channeling 
uh, different beings, but mostly the um, Arcturian Council. But he also channeled the creators. And it felt when I uh, came across the first channeling from Daniel about the creators, it felt the same energy that I that I felt when I watched the scene in the clouds. And when I watched very, <clears throat> very closely, this one sitting dangling legs on the on the cloud with uh, the focus in his marble um, glass bowl with uh, galaxies in there. Suddenly another one from the people on the cloud, he stood up and walked over to this one, which I was watching. And he looked over his shoulder into the ball of the other one. And I got the idea, wow, that's why they're so, so focused. They're all having their own domain in this marble where they um, care for their galaxies as creators. And they also incarnate into their own creations. And the one that was looking over the shoulder of the one sitting on the edge of the cloud, he focused and also incarnated in the creation of his colleague. And this happened all around the cloud. They were not only for themselves, but they also examined the uh, marbles or glass balls with swirling galaxies in the hands of the others and incarnated sometimes in their creations. So I got an idea about creation and the creators and how this maybe works. So I hope you can get something out of that and it will give you some good ideas about creation and the creators. Thank you for listening and I wish you all the best. Love and light onto your soul journey. Thank you for watching.